Hello everyone, this is a video to help you remember the plant poison and their common names which are frequently asked in the exams. Now this is in reference with the marrow pearl number 2105. So once you watch this video, go back to the pearl and you can easily recall each one of them. So let's start. The first poison is conium maculatum. Now, it is known as poison hemlock. So how to remember this? See here, this is a cone. Now you must have seen these ice cream cones. And you don't want your siblings or your friends to eat them. So you lock them away somewhere safer. So conium is for hemlock. The second one, digitalis purpura. Now, where do you apply? your gloves on your digits the fingers on your hands are known as digits so on your digits you apply glove you put on glove so digitalis is for fox glove the third one neum odorum now it's very easy there's odor and oleander obviously oleander has a sweet odor has a very good odor so neum odorum is for white oleander so why is it white is there any other odorum is there any other oleander yes there is also a yellow oleander which is known as cerebra thivasia cerebra thivasia okay the next is resinus communis now resinus so this is a very important from this word r you can remember the resinus is a red colored plant and from c you can remember three things it is also known as castor second is the plant i've already told it is red color and it looks like cactus plant very thorny like something like this and the next C is for the fruit so the fruit looks like a cockroach okay so it's very mottled you will see mottling something like this so from R it is red colored from C it is castor the plant looks like cactus plant and the seed are similar to a cockroach very ugly looking the next is abrus picatorius abrus picatorius uh, you must have known you must be knowing it is used as a sui for cattle poisoning so how i remember it abruk so it's not abrus it abruk so like i'm saying to the cattle ki abruk I'm going to kill you with this sui and it is also known as rosary pea, ratti seed and gunchi then aconite now separate the word as a cone so where do you put a cone on a monk's head so here is a monk and you put a hood on his head so this is aconite now this might be confusing when there is conium also conium so here you can remember as cones there are many cones not just one there are many cones and you put them in the locker but here it is only one cone a cone and you can't put multiple cones on a head you can only put one single hat the next is atropa belladonna now Atropa Belladonna is a very beautiful girl, Bella or Donna, whatever. And she is very beautiful. And if you remember the Atropa, the effect on eyes, it is anti muscarinic so it will dilate the pupil. So this Belladonna, this girl has very beautiful big eyes. And with this big eyes, she looks at deadly night said. So the name is Deadly Nightshade because it looks deadly in a big beautiful eyes. I hope it was helpful.
now you can refer back to this board number 2105 and you can easily recall whatever I have said in this entire video and you can easily correlate thank you very much for watching please do like comment and subscribe to this channel and also hit the bell icon so that you keep receiving newer videos when I upload them very frequently